It is time for your tropical weather update. I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Kevin Roth. The big story here is the potential for some development right off the Texas Gulf Coast. So let's start with that here. Uh, those development odds are not high. 0% over the next two days, 20% over the next five days. And then you see that other area of potential development that's in the eastern Atlantic. Again, that's still far enough out where that is not a major concern, although that is more likely to develop. Let's focus on what we're seeing in the Gulf here. And as we put future track into motion, you'll notice there's no clear organization, more of a mess of scattered showers and storms and a low pressure will certainly develop. Uh, but I'm not expecting anything particularly powerful or damaging here. It's just the chance for more rain. And that's what we want and that's what we need as you move through the beginning and middle of next week as that low pressure forms. It really does up those rain chances without seeing any significant potential for development, which is a great thing to see. Now, on the flip side of that, our other storm that we were watching that was out in the open Atlantic, that is more likely to develop. That's more likely to become the next name storm, Bonnie, but is less likely to have any direct impact on us here in Texas. Going to be watching both of those areas, of course, as we go forward. But the bottom line is that low pressure that is likely to develop in the Gulf does up our rain chances, especially early and middle parts of next week. I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Kevin Roth, and that's a look at your tropical weather update.